Strictly for me is very special because I watched it since series one. Um, and you know, when I was living in Ireland before I even moved over to London and started working TV. Uh, and for me to even be sitting here just feels extremely surreal. You know, it's the chance to, to learn a skill um, from one of the best dancers in the world. You don't get that all the time. I love dancing. For me, any of my friends just know if we're on a night out and the music comes on, I'm on the dance floor. What I'm doing on the dance floor is questionable. I mean, there's arms and legs everywhere. Um, a bit like Bambi and Ice, I have been told. I was a bit overwhelmed initially when I first walked in and saw all the costumes because I, I love fashion, I love dressing up, and I'm probably not used to so many sequins, but I have managed to have a chance to try on a few little bits and pieces, and I don't know, maybe it's something to do with a character, but I tried on one of these dresses, and I suddenly just felt like I wasn't really Laura anymore, that you know maybe I could be this really great dancer. Ballroom or Latin? Um, I, in my head, I probably think Latin, because I, I quite like the way it's a little bit more out there. Ballroom seems a little bit more, what's the word, kind of contained and, and, and you know I'm not very good at, even when I'm talking to you now my arms are everywhere, I'm not very good at standing still. My dance partner will have to appreciate that I talk a lot and that's my problem and I know with, with even my job, you know, going into a TV studio I get told off for, you know, talking to everyone and like, okay Laura you actually have to get down to business and do what you're supposed to do. They'll probably have to be a little bit disciplined and strict and tell me to shut up. Uh, and, and do the dance. But also I like to have a laugh and a bit of banter as well. So I want someone I can have fun with because it is scary in one way because it's totally out of my comfort zone. So I kind of want to make it as enjoyable as possible. So I hope that they're fun.